So today I'm going to be showing you the Loop Station RC3 by Boss. And I've really enjoyed using this pedal a lot. It allows me to be very creative in songwriting and uh, especially with soloing. It's, it's been really great for developing those skills. So here's a brief rundown. The uh, inner knob is for the rhythm. Uh, there's a metronome that is included in the pedal software itself and the rhythm on and off button right there. Uh, you can change the, the tempo with the tap tempo button. I haven't loved this feature because it's a little bit finicky, but it is still useful uh, just to be able to, to keep time and practice. And then the, the outer knob there is to control the volume of the loop itself. And it has a hundred different loops that uh, you can save material to. So that's really nice. And I think the overall uh, time of material you can save to the loop pedal is about five or six hours, which is more than enough, really. And if you do run out of space, there is a USB uh, port on the back that you can connect your computer to and download all of your songs or loops or whatnot. And uh, there's also an auxiliary in port right there, and uh, what I often do is I'll take my drums or whatever on from my computer and I'll plug it in using an auxiliary cable and then I'll save it to the pedal itself and then I can practice along to the drums playing through my amplifier. So uh, I'll just do a little demo here and show you the pedal. And if you want to record something, you just hold down that until you get the record, and then you press and save it like that. Um, and just overall, this pedal's been great. It's about $200 from what I remember, so it's a little bit pricey. But the utility it has, especially for a one-man band like myself, can make you sound like a, a full band, especially... Um, at my live shows, I use this to hold my drums, uh, and then I'll I play this through the PA speakers. And so, uh, yeah, the the Boss RC3 is a very very useful uh, pedal for myself, and I highly recommend it to anyone that's looking to sort of develop a uh, repertoire of material. So until next time, cheers.